Hey, welcome to Draft Academy. My name is Mike. In this really quick tutorial, I just want to talk to you about using the middleman build command and basically building our websites so that we can then publish them onto a web server. So over here, I have this website that I've been working on throughout the course. And in this source folder, I just have a bunch of files that I created. So we have this index.html file, which is like the home page. And then we have this b.markdown file. We have this ahtml file. And then inside of directory one, we have this c.html file. So imagine that you're done building your website and you have all of your files that you want to go on your website. How do you then get those files so that you can upload them onto your web server? There's a very simple middleman command that we can use and it's just middleman and build. And basically what this is going to do is it's going to take all of the stuff on your website. So, you know, those ERB pages, maybe any images or any code, and it's just going to compile it all together and build out your final static website. And so it'll give you, it'll spit out all of those final static web pages. So I'm just going to click enter and you can see that it's creating a bunch of different pages. And now when we head over to our project directory, you'll notice that there's a new folder here and it's called build. And inside this build folder, this is actually our entire website. So we have this like index.html file, BA, we have our style sheets, um, our JavaScript, any of our images, and then directory one, we have that c.html file. So this is like our final website that's, you know, built together and it's all of our static pages that we can then upload to a web server. So obviously there's you know, a bunch of different ways that you can serve your website. And I, that's a little bit beyond the scope of this course. You know, this course is more just about using middleman and learning how to use it and obviously using that build command. But now what you can do is just take these files, upload them onto your web server, or, you know, however it is that you're going to be hosting your website and it should just work. Hey, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe to Draft Academy to be the first to know when we release new content. Also, we're always looking to improve, so if you have any constructive criticism or questions or anything, leave a comment below. Finally, if you're enjoying Draft Academy and you want to help us grow, head over to draftacademy.com forward slash contribute and invest in our future.